Hello, hello. We're, we're playing more Ori. Uh, apparently, I'm to about a quarter way through with the game. And four and a half hours. So, some quick mass would indicate that it'll take me 18 hours to beat the game. Total. So, I mean, we'll, we'll see how accurate that is. Um, I think before, we kind of ended off with the game giving you the main storyline. Um, let's see if it kind of tells us what it is. Yeah, okay. So, I don't know if these are all... Yeah, okay. So, if you look in the top left, you can see I have one, two, three, four, five little mini quests. Um, essentially, my buddy is critically injured. And we need to save him. Um, it's a little owl baby. We love him. His name is Ku. Alright, let me remember how to play a game. Uh, so anyways, there's five places we have to visit. Each one of these is a will-o'-wisp. <laughs> well, I have to study. No! You got things to do. I thought exams would be over for most people. All my friends are done with exams. <laughs> I'm, you know, I guess other people got a few left. This is Ori and the Will of the Wisps. Um, if you haven't played it, it's kind of like Microsoft's version of Hollow Knight. Um, you play as a cute little guy named Ori. It's a little fox thing. And you're generally trying to do positive things for your environment. Uh, but over overall, we're trying to save our buddy. And there's cool little platforming bits to do. It's a great game. And we're, <laughs> the Doritos are back. Thank God. That's what this, this is what I've been missing, is Doritos. For me, it's 9 a.m., so Doritos is probably the meal of the day. I gotta figure out where I'm supposed to be going. Uh, let's see here. Okay. I need to get will o -Wiss. Where would I go to get that thing? <laughs> it's a pretty good game. I don't think it really matters which way I go. This map, like, go away. It looks like this area over here is pretty unexplored. It's probably a good place to start. So let's go back and fast travel. Yeah, the game's pretty well... Yeah, it's pretty popular. <laughs> I think most people gave it a 9 or a 10 on, like, a review scale. Uh, Microsoft's Indie Studios. I, can't, I think it's just made by Xbox Game Studios. <clears throat> but they, they put a lot of effort into it. Like, you can tell just by the music behind it that they they really committed a lot of money to this <laughs> oh like there's a lot of games that indie developers make that have like really basic musical choices and that's a pretty good indication of how much money was spent on the game you can devote like a whole concert studio or a whole orchestra to developing a soundtrack for your game Let's see if we can bump you into you. All right, let's let's remember what my combat options are. I got a sword. I haven't played this game in like a week, so I'm trying to remember how to play it right. So we got these guys. They like to yeet down at me. How did you? <laughs> Red guys explode. All right, we got kamikaze bugs and then general bugs. Alright, so we want this guy to come at us. Hmm. I guess we can shoot him. <laughs> that might be good. How does... They just read me so well. How does it know which way I'm going to dodge? Alright. Um, so we actually want to go... Actually, we can go up here. Potentially. Or to the left. Or maybe I can't get over this tree. Got it. <laughs> so I guess we're going to... I guess it's to the right. My directions are not very good. So let's go up here. Was there a sleeping bear here before? Okay, there's something to jump off of right here. So there's got to be something good up here somewhere. Otherwise, why would they let me get up here, you know? Mm, maybe not. Maybe there's nothing here for me. So... 
Let's go this way. Oh, this is where our, our owl friend got pushed off a ledge. All right, yellow guys also explode. <laughs> Everything here tends to explode is what I'm learning. So previously we had this big owl thing named Shriek. Um, it looks like an owl, but then it grows like human legs out of it. It's some uh, monstrosity produced by evil and chaos. Um, I was sent down this little path, the thing I'm jumping over, and I end up being okay. Meanwhile, Shriek like yeeted my boy off this ledge. Oh, wait, we can get across here. Yeah, is that where I'm supposed to- why does this exist? Why does this weird little platforming puzzle exist? I don't know. So this is where my owl fell and we had to like, save him. <laughs> well, we didn't save him very well. We, we took his body to like, get restored, but he needs these life orbs to, to get back to life. And that's what we're trying to collect right now. Hmm. see where am i going Woo! dodged it <laughs> um let's see here so i guess this is just made as a path to get up so let's get back up here and then jump across that makes sense to me Yeah, okay, so that was literally just a path to get up. It wasn't like a fun platforming puzzle. All right, we got a rock in a, in a hammock. What the hell was that? <laughs> um, okay. There was, okay, there's definitely worms in the sand for sure, right? So that's Shriek, this is Shriek. This abomination of nature. It's like a bird with legs and it's terrifying. So we should get a fun little escape sequence if I had to guess. We want to hide behind me. Oh! All right, hide. Be barely quiet. God, and then it like covers itself in the bones of its enemies. Oh! Doesn't see us. Doesn't see us. Doesn't know where I am. A quick watch, looking that way. Nope. Where am I? You'll never find me. Oh, I'm gone. This seemed like a bad move now that I'm looking at it. Woo! Damn it. Ah, this part of the game. Is this known for being hard? Annoying? No, no, no. no. Wait, wait. I keep doing that. That is X. That is Y. And then that is where we're Get, get. I was, oh. I keep messing up my buttons for dash and, and like grapple. It's fine, but it definitely took me a while to understand where to go. Okay, got it. Oh, that is not the way. Also, like why is sometimes it knows, where you, like sometimes you're safe to hide, other times it's not safe to hide. All right, so we go in here. Bird misses us, we dive down. I don't, I pressed the correct trigger. So now we're up here. Bird has already killed us. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. So we hide here again, this is fine. Do I have enough time to even go up there? God. Okay, it definitely sees us this way. Is it like a, just a speed-based thing? Because I can do it faster, for sure. Or is there another hiding spot? Whew, I don't know if it's speed-based. If it's speed-based, I'd be definitely be able to get this done. Alright. So, bird's looking that way. Hmm. 
<laughs> Shriek. You gotta give me a chance here. You know, it's not fun if you're just omnipotent and just can't be stopped. Alright. So... Oh, we can hide in here, maybe? No. Can't hide in there. <laughs> Alright. You got this? I'll figure it out eventually. There's only so many places to go. Go back. Nope. Dang. Alright, the bird? <laughs> we'll figure this out. Where's the bird? Okay, the bird looks to the left here. And then we're good to go to the right. Yeah, the bird has seen me. It's past the point of no return. Okay. Jeez. What do we just wait here? What happens if we do nothing? Let's figure that out. Okay. He does not move at all. He is locked in that position. Oh, the scary bird. Yeah. The the bird with like human legs on top of bird legs. We're at this point. How does it see me? Where do I go? This is definitely the first step. You definitely go in here first to avoid the bird seeing you. And then you gotta go up. Oh, am I not supposed to hit that? Am I supposed to avoid the bones? Is that what said it? I think the bones trigger the bird to see me. Is that what's going on here? Nope, the bird just sees me regardless. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, let's see. When does the bird... Okay, the bird is looking to there. And then he looks down. When does it see me? Everyone's saying... Alright, so it's just bad game design. That's what, We can blame it on the game design, not telling me exactly where to go. I appreciate everyone letting me know that everyone has a difficult this year. Alright, alright. Give me the map. Okay, the map is not helpful. Um, let's see here. There's sand on the ground. Do you think I can- I can't blow away sand. I don't think- like, I have this cool flapping mechanic. But I don't think that's the intention. No, the, the, the feather cannot blow away sand. That is something I've learned. All right. Okay, now getting hit by the bird also hurts you. Good to know, good to know. All right, I'm running out of strategies. Oh! Nope. I thought I, I thought I had some there. I was incorrect. So let's. Right, the bird looks that way. We go up. Can I like go? Maybe I can I go up in that thing? Is there space for me to like hide in that thing right above me? A little like bone capsule. Answer is no. Can't hide in there. Alright. And then it collapses this thing I'm standing in, so I can't like run back to it. Hmm. Did the bird not see me at a point? Can I like. So, like, if I do this... Nope, bird sees me there. That was a part for me, for sure. I was like, I got a strategy. Oh, nope, that's not it. Oh, whoops. And that, that's exactly what I'm going for. Trying every little different... Thank God this isn't, like, a, a soul's bit. Give me all this sand. Oh! 
what about there? Maybe I can get to like there? Or maybe I can swing on that little platform to give me enough movement? Nope, it sees me there. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'm trying to get up and to the left. That is the goal. So once I'm here, it definitely sees me. But it gave it, it moved a little differently there. It actually walked up over there. Now, what if I get it? What if I like shoot this way? Nope. Fade it. I'm over there. Okay, that time, if I touch the skulls, it gets me immediately. So I think the goal is here to not make noise. So everything skull based makes noise and ultimately kills me. So this thing. Okay. Uh, the, the pole also makes noise, also sees me. I am, <laughs> I'm so confused. Do I bait it into doing something? <sighs> what? What is it? Okay, going backwards also kills you. Can't go over it, can't go under it, can't go through it, can't battle it. Well, I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> mm, pain. Alright. What is the move here? Definitely saw me there. I just... Like, I'm good at platforming, I can move well. But it's the fact, like, I can't move invisibly. There's not, like, skills that I have to help. That's not a spirit shard thing. I can't use items. My, these things are shoot, attack, regenerate. And it's not like, I have, it's, I have the skills to do it. It's, it won't let me leave this area. Like, it's not like I'm missing, like, a, a Metroidvania attack. I, I will take a hint, if you're offering a hint. I feel like, you know, 15 minutes in this section has been long enough to be like, alright, I'll take a little bit of a... a hit. And I'll probably be like, oh, that's what you do. Can I... I can't, like, climb through sand, can I? You have the first part right with hiding in that recess. There are other places to hide. Alright, alright. So I gotta... It's all about different places to hide along the way. Gotcha. I appreciate the help. Spicy meat roll. <laughs> okay. You can call you meat. <laughs> That's funny. There's another person that, uh, in my Twitch chat named... Uh, something like lasagna. It's funny how many food based names are. You think you're gonna hide behind this? Yes! Apparently, this little flap is enough to hide behind. That's. I don't know why that took me so long to figure out. Nope. Alright. You be lasagna? Yeah. Uh, normally, I stream like later in the day, so I don't know what his schedule's like. <laughs> I'm sure he'll pop in eventually. He's a good guy, too. He helped me a lot with other games. <laughs> Most of the things I do on here are like first playthroughs, so I'm not as aware of what to do in different instances. Alright, so let's see. I can hide behind this thing, probably. No, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm not even here. Do you leave? Most of you first play through hill. Hint chat into the best. Yeah, because it's really hard to get like a hit based thing um, online. Basically, all you get is like a pure walkthrough of what to do in every situation. And like, you're not always looking for that. Sometimes you just need like 
maybe you can try this. Just another way of looking at a problem that you might not have thought of initially. Instead of being like, go, go there, hide behind this wall, wait there for three seconds, move to the left fast, you know. Sometimes the dice just getting a, a general hit. That one, he's definitely gonna kill me. Oh, no, he didn't. All right, now we do the, uh, the fun. Wait. Oh, wait, we're done. Nice. All right. Whew, thank God. <laughs> we are through. Whoop. All right. Ooh, I wonder if I get a tunneling ability. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, it, like the actual the actual thing only took like maybe 20 seconds. <laughs> but figuring out how to do it took a while. Oh, Slays is here too? You guys are up way too early on a Friday. Aw, oh, thanks for the follow, meat. You can see ghosts in the sand here, Ori. This is the home to the gore like before the decay drove underground. That's why all 9 would be coming if we can't bring it back to light. Oh, it's late where you are? That makes sense. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> Not everyone exists in the same time frame as I do. Oh, this guy now got projectiles. Alright, shoot me. I want to show him back at you. Yeah, do it again. Idiot. <laughs> do it again. Alright, now these worms are my least favorite thing. It's 1120 there? Jeez, where are you from, Slays? I guess it's just Europe and... Well, okay, so Western Europe is like six hours behind me. Or ahead of me. And then, so I guess it's Korea. Interesting. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I kind of need that guy to throw a purple ball at me. So I can break this. And I will do it later. Alright, uh, I don't need to kill the worms. I do want to get that money. These guys don't shoot me, to my understanding. Alright, where am I going? So it looks like there's some money up there. I was born in France, but moved to Korea for my work to be easier. Huh. Whoa. Is it like the company based in Korea? You just moved there because, like, to be closer to the work? I'm sure if it's like, you know, internet based, you can do it from anywhere. I'm not sure. <laughs> I've never moved country to country for my work. I've moved like in the same country, but not to different areas of the world. <laughs> that was good. Oh. Ooh, a shovel. Can I use the shovel to dig? No. All right, that was just left behind. Okay, I, I feel like I'm gonna get a burrow ability Eventually, there's a lot of sand here and that gives me the I nope That's just what I'm I'm thinking Now it's based in the UK, but I travel around a lot. Gotcha Huh Oh, this guy's got the cool explosion Dang Let's try shooting him. Or let's avoid him. Oh, can you not climb them? Okay, there we go. Okay, this guy's good at jumping. <coughs> he just can't stop. He's addicted to shindig. Oh, so hitting these things. Alright. I can't do any damage to them when they got their shell on. And it gives me like a bounce back thing. That's a lot of cool traveling. My buddy would love to have that job. He loves traveling more than anything. And he just can't have, he doesn't have like a reason to do it. So it's all like on his own time. He's gotta take like leave from work. And pay for the whole trip. I'm sure like working at a place that encourages. Oh my God, what a, what a hammer. Not better than my Ori sword, though. You're watching a show? What does that mean? <laughs> am I the show? <laughs> I guess I am a form of entertainment. 
It's not as well produced as a Netflix original. <laughs> oh yeah, The Witcher came- Dude, I feel like they really missed the ball on marketing. I didn't realize that show was coming out till today. Uh, I saw like something on Reddit where Henry Cavill was just like, Hey guys, I know you've been wait waiting for The Witcher Season 2 for 18 years. Um, it's out today. And I was like, how did I not know about this till today? But I'm, just, I'm super excited to watch it too. I'll probably, um, I'm going, I'm going to my parents' house for Christmas. So I'll probably find some time there to watch it. While, you know, I'm trying to find stuff to do. But I really like the first season. I'm excited to see what they do in the second season. I haven't played any of the games. My brother loves the, uh, The Witcher Specifically, like, The Witcher 3. Oh, that spikes too. Okay. But I just couldn't get into it. I stay up to date on Netflix. I spent... So, I got a... I got my COVID booster shot yesterday, or on Wednesday. And so, like, yesterday I felt like complete crap. <laughs> uh, so, I spent a lot of time just watching crappy Christmas movies on Netflix and, like, Hulu and Disney. Ooh. Okay, I can get up there. Yeah. Cobra Kai. So Cobra Kai used to be on like Hulu or on YouTube, right? Traveler, word. No, don't worry. I escaped the corruption that befell my kin, but there is one problem. You don't have to have any water, do you? Not that I'm thirsty. He wants water. And then okay. So, Cobra, is Cobra Kai based on the Karate Kid? Isn't it the, uh, kind of the story of the, the main villain from that show? Oh, it sure is. is definitely the Burrow ability. For sure. For sure. Because it's got the same actor as, like, the villain from the original. Literally called the Burrow ability. Alright. Woo! Alright, I'm like a little fish now. Alright, interesting. So we can get some speed and then go whoop and do stuff like this. I will say one thing. I feel like Ori has a little bit, it might have too many mechanics. At least like the first one, they kind of overwhelmed you with mechanics. And it seems like this one probably would do something similar. But we'll figure it out. Based on the Karate Kid, but the main actors are now the- wait- Oh, okay. I get it. Oh, I can burrow through those rocks! Oh, that's sick. Because I guess the Karate Kid already built the kind of world, and they just created a story within that world, which is nice. They don't do new world building. They already got the, the main foundation laid. They can just explore new um, plot points. Dang, that is crazy they had to get the rights to the Karate Kid to make that show, though. Anyway, we're gonna get a map here, because I like maps. And I'm sure this area gets a lot more expansive than I originally thought. Yeah! <laughs> like that. What is this thing? Alright. Uh, where am I trying to go? So there is a race thing there. And races are great because they give you just a crap load of uh, money. So I think I'm going to do that right quick. We're going to go down here and get the start of that. And we'll do that. That sounds like fun. Uh, so i got to go this way. This guy wants water. I unfortunately cannot give him the water that he so desperately needs. Alright. Oh, no. We're going to need to burst through this a little faster. And grab that money. Oh, I can just attack the sandworms like this now. Ah. Oh my god, that's so much better than before. Just waiting on top. To oh, this is great. Her ability is sick. Alright, we're gonna go over here. Alright, then it looks like the other pedestal is like this way. Nope, nope, nope. This way. There it is. Okay. So 
So let's run the speed run. So we're going up through here, up around there, through this, through that sand, up this around there, and it's going straight left to a, basically just the tree. I'm sure we'll figure it out. Alright, we're way ahead of the curve here. I have forgotten where to go. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm behind. We can do this. Oh, we can't. Okay. Do it again. Do it again. Alright, trying to figure out where to go is the is the hard part. Alright, go to this one, go to this one. Burrow through this, get some extra speed. Get up here, burrow through this, speed around. Oh, wait, wait, I needed to actually get enough speed here to do this. And then we go straight down through here. And then it's just a race to the left, pretty much. Oh. Woo, no problem. Dota Dragon's Blood coming? So is that... Okay, because they did have a, a lot of success on Arcane. I haven't watched Arcane yet, but everyone who I've talked to that watched it, like, thinks it's phenomenal. And I think that's the general consensus, even on, like, Rotten Tomatoes and everything. Alright, so this guy's gonna throw a purple orb at me. <laughs> I need to bait him in here farther. Hmm... So I need to use these pur purple orb to break this wall over here. Also avoiding the sand bones. Okay, he's already walked this far. Alright. Heck, he might just throw it at me. Just do the thing. Okay, bruh. Do it better than that. There we go. What? Did I miss? Do it again. Not the hammer. Purple thing. Purple thing. Is that not what I used to break this? All right, I guess not. Dota already has a show on Netflix too. Is that? Oh wait, wait. I, I'm thinking of League of Legends. Is that? I'm not very familiar with the the RTS game community. Which one is Dota? <laughs> I guess we'll just go up here. Already got that. Probably just follow the path we used for the little race. Hmm. There we go. Um, I'm thinking... Well, there's probably something good down there. So actually, we're gonna go do that. <laughs> or die. One or the other. We would either go down there or die. So now, let's see, I need to go down here. Burrow. Oh, okay, it's a little maze. Okay, that's fine. Now we just have to do that and grab that. Nice. There's, al there's always benefit in exploring the map. That's why I think this game does really well. Because they give you really good reason to... Uh, Explore because literally every crevice has some like up there. I just know there's got to be something positive I don't even know what that is uh, Let's try Doing something like this And yep life self right good. Is that what's marked in the map? Yeah Yeah, it's great. I will say like the map design and the way they did everything was works really well in this and the new combat is much improved of the original. Just the sword mechanic alone just improves this so much. Having a directional ability on how you, um... Woo! Okay. On how you do things. Dota is likely, but way older. Was Dota the one that, it, like, 
Isn't League of Legends from Dota? Wasn't there like a customizable tool in there to help people like make their own games and people use that to create the original original League of Legends? Is that okay? Gotcha. Okay, so Dota's the OG, the OG homie. No, stop dashing. I want you to go in here. So now we're over here. We can break that wall. And we can see what's good over here, you know? Like a heart upgrade. Dota came out in 2003. League of Legends was 2009. So a little bit of a gap. Uh, let's see here. This guy's here. We're just gonna blast him with his own stuff, I think. Or we could just come up here. I don't think I need to kill them at all. There's the money. Is that the only thing you got in here? That's all we needed to get. We don't need to murder them at all. And we outcha. Except for this guy, who definitely is not gonna make this as easy as I would. Oh, we're out, okay. All right, so now we can actually Team Rocket blast off again with this thing. I, I want to go up there, so let's do that. Yep. All right, cool. So this thing... Okay, I see the puzzle here. So we need, we need to break each one of these and let it shoot that and that will give us some ore nope it gives me a spirit shard you gained a new spirit shard deal 20 percent more damage than below 15 percent life i don't think we'll ever be below that we have way too many hearts for that uh, so let's see if i can yep do exactly that no there's money there all right there we go there's the money. Alright, where to next? Okay, I don't want to equip that new spirit shard. There's no way out of there. Uh, we can either go this looping path or that one. I guess we're going to go back here. I want to grab whatever is in there. <laughs> so we can just go... Whoop, and we're going to the left. Just avoiding every enemy. Now we can get up here. Murder that thing, grab whatever it gives me. Use the pole. Yeah, we just go in left to right here. Not a big, gosh. I keep using the wrong button input. All right, well that's free. Um, Is there something up here? Yeah, there definitely is. Free. They, will, they do give you a ton of uh, <laughs> life orbs and energy stuff, which is great. Whew. Sometimes being speedy isn't always... Oh my god, we're gonna die. <laughs> we actually need to go up into here and then across. What's in here? Another life orb upgrade. Jeez Louise, these things are everywhere. All right, ignore the sandworms. Blast into spikes. Didn't we already do this? Yeah, we already did that. All right, so we're going up. I'm gonna grab this to give me some more hell. I guess I can always. Yeah, I'm not using any energy. I guess I can just heal up. Oh, well, that'd be an issue. There. Yeah, so... I mean, Netflix does do its own anime, but they're just not as good as, like... Like, Crunchyroll is always going to be your site for, like, anime stuff. And I just don't think they want to... Where the hell am I? Where... Where... Um... Uh, yeah, I guess Netflix is like, hey, we just we're investing in other shows. We're not gonna do since other people already did anime so much better than us. We're not gonna invest in it. Would be my guess. But it's hard to say. I think as it becomes more popular, more mainstream, 
they'll probably invest more money into it. I don't know. Netflix, Netflix has this ability where they just kind of they kind of throw everything at something and see see what sticks. So they'll they'll buy anyone a season one of a show. Oh god. And then they kind of gauge whether it's worth a season two. I wonder why he attacks with his fist instead of the hammer. Like, that seems so counterproductive. Oh, there's the hammer. I guess the hammer takes longer to charge up. Netflix has a lot of shows. I mostly like Korean dramas. <laughs> so, I mean, the only Korean... <laughs> only Korean show I've watched... Well, I watched Parasite, and then I watched um, Squid Game, because everyone wouldn't stop talking about it. And I needed to have some, like... <laughs> I feel like I needed to watch it just to be able to communicate with these people. Like, oh, you haven't seen Squid Game? You gotta see Squid Game. Yeah, I thought it was good. Yeah, I'm definitely, I'm down with the subtitle life. Ooh, how do I get up there? That is a good question. So maybe what I'd do is kind of direct it that way. Hmm. The show, it's called King's Avatar, and it's a gaming Korean drama. So that, like, about, like, StarCraft. We're not necessarily StarCraft, but, like, like an esports team. I don't know if I can get up there. The more I look at this, the more I think it's not possible. Hmm. I'm gonna keep trying. So what? what is like the main plot point? What makes it a gaming drama? Are they in a game? <laughs> or are they developing a game? Or are they competitively playing a game? God, I feel like I gotta get up there. There's definitely a way to do it. And we're gonna figure it out. So this one is fairly straightforward. You go left to right. I do have the triple jump upgrade. Oh! Alright. There's that. Gotta focus here for... Nah! About a guy who's a professional gamer for a team with a lot of accomplishments saying leaves and starts his own team to make glory another way. Okay. I can get behind that. So it's the competitive competitive because I honestly I don't know a lot about the training regimen and whatnot involved in professional gaming like I'll watch gameplay um, I specifically watch uh, Rocket League competitive gameplay that's that's my favorite esport all right so we're gonna focus for like a second so now we go this oh nice you've gained a new spirit shard enemies respawn faster I don't know if I need that one <laughs> I don't know if I needed to come up here at all, <laughs> looking back on it. Alright, I go down. And we're out. I will say not- I feel like the spirit shards aren't, like, they're really hard to figure out what when to use them and when not to. Uh, this is where we got the key shard. We don't actually need to come back here. So we can do something like this. Perfect. Yeah, I'm not going to equip that one. I don't really... I need two key... Okay, where's the other one at? <laughs> oh, it tells me straight up where the other one at. That's pretty good. I see what I'm supposed to do. All right. So we kind of hop around this and then get back up and then get hit. And then we just kind of work our way. Oh, no, I'm dead. 
Oh, that's that's good. Oh, no, it didn't count me as having that other key fragment. Okay, so we'll go get that one again. That one is fine. Woo. Um, how do we get back up? Try. I guess we can go around like this. That will be fun. Yeah, something like that. All right. Let me throw the key fragments in there, and we'll keep going. Is there something up here? Okay, this is the beneath shifting sands. Whatever. Now, I assume the burrow ability will let us go to other parts of the map we weren't able to get to before. Ooh, he almost got me there, bud. Oh, too slow. And you did. All right, now how do I break this? <laughs> do I need to break that? Well, we'll first burrow down here. Do I need to like get this thing up here? I guess that was it. All right. Um, okay, now this one down there seems a little bit more difficult. So I guess I want this thing to shoot out like that. Okay, kind of corner, we just need to take him out. And now we can try to get this thing to shoot out. Yeah. We need to angle it down. <laughs> oh, or have it kill me. And this guy's back. We love seeing him. Oh, it didn't even save the first one. Rough. God. <laughs> All right. I wonder if I can burrow down and then I can just do this. Oh, and this, now this is combat. Now I'm a, oh, okay, now I'm dead. Now this is pod racing. I did watch the Lego uh, Star Wars holiday special yesterday and I love that thing. You've been on the inside of gaming community scenes? What does that entail? Like, does that mean like you're like a journalist? Or are you like setting up events for gaming communities? God. So we're getting the timing down for when you're going. Oh, come on. You, you, bam, 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 down the ground, up. Down, bam, 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 down the ground, up again, down, down. A little bit telling it is, I think the tunneling's fun, especially when they have like people that can't tunnel and you can kind of just dodge around them. Ooh, also there's a thing up there. Ooh. I don't know how to get that. I've been playing and sometimes helping out. Ooh, so, can, like, what competitive games do you play? So I think if I remember correctly, you do platforming games. So like, are you do, do you do like the, the Hollow Knight, like Hunter, Speedrunner ones? That's like the only. <laughs> All right, there's that. Now we're gonna go around. I'm not gonna bother breaking that. I don't really need it. Now, this guy is just a bit of a monster. We're gonna take care of him. You used to play League of Legends and Call of Duty and Halo. Oh, a jack of all trades. Uh, was so like now? What is? I remember watching. I went to some conference and they had. <laughs> it's actually really funny. They had the competitive esports team for. The Navy and the competitive esports. No, no, no. It was the Air Force versus SpaceX, <laughs> which is the um, America's like. I 
guess they're like the air aircraft pilots as well as the people that are in charge of our space force i don't know but they were playing call of duty uh what is it they're uh war zone they were playing the they're doing that dang so i need to do i need to, i actually need to get up there so i actually need to get this thing up here then i probably need to redirect it into where i want it to go So what's your favorite of the competitive scene? Like, like which one did you like playing in the most? Dang it. Can I not bash off that thing? Maybe not close enough. All right, come here again. There we go. All right, so now we can go move this thing. Which opens that door. <sighs> League of Legends is getting to meet people. Yeah, League of Legends is like worldwide. I bet that's super cool. It's like going place to place, going to events, meeting people from all different walks of life that all have this one thing in common. They're all really freaking good. <laughs> At a video game. Woo! Close. Um, dang! I ain't at the ground there, so I should get a loading zone. Money up there. Faker? Oh, dang. I, I would love to tell you that I knew who Faker was. <laughs> I feel like... Is he a League of Legends god? Is he the North American League of Legends player that's really, really, really good? Or am I being stupid? Oh my god. What is this? What the hell am I doing? Alright, so I got the money. He plays for... Okay, he's... He plays for Kuka. Got it. And I'm sure... Is he top one in the world? How long... What is the career of a, a League of Legends, like, a professional player? Like, is it... Is it like, all right, like, you're only good for, you know, five years, and then, like, your reactability is not as good, or people learn new things? Or is it like, a, you know, you play forever? Like, the top one, how long has Faker been, like, number one? Except they're with the best. <laughs> Depends on the person. Okay. Gotcha. What's like the average age for a for a League of Legends player? Are they relatively young or are they like in their twenties? Cause again, the scene that I'm most familiar with is the Rocket League one. And I feel like they I think the average age is way lower now, where players are like sixteen as opposed to being like twenty-five. Frick. I figure out what I'm supposed to be doing. So I can't, I guess I could go this way. I don't think I can go slowly enough to make it up that way. So I have to go around to the left. I think I gotta figure out a good pathway. Oh man. So when you played, are you were you on a team, or um, did you just play for like fun? Oh, oh, I can go. Oh, okay, I figured it out. We're, we're fine. Easy peasy. I don't know. I could hide inside those little recesses. 
I'm gonna bounce off you. I'm gonna bounce off you. I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna go across. So I definitely want to get this four point. I feel like that's gonna be real helpful. Wasn't it orc for a bit? They weren't as big as most orcs. Yeah, I feel like that's <laughs> that's that's something I never really realized was how many smaller gaming um, organizations there were. Like obviously not everyone can be playing for a top tier team. And there's gotta be oh my god, there's something down here. I'm gonna get this thing. Okay, so I think the move here is to blast off that thing into that hanging field pile of sand. And then go from there. So we'll get you. I don't think we had enough height on that one. Alright, we'll go back and do it again. Oh, righty. Gonna come with you. Nope, you're gonna blast over there. Okay, that's okay. That's not where I wanted to go. Come over here. Come around. I think that's enough. Well, I want this. What does this do? A seed. I'm sure that's important. I want to get the Gorlack ore to rebuild my civilization. I want to go this way. Nope, that wasn't enough. This is enough. There we go. Woo. Let's go. Oh, it didn't, it didn't tell me I got the ore until I, I came to a stopping point. All right. We should be, yeah, we're right next to the, okay, let's see what these will o wisps are. Oh, it's a dungeon. Okay, so it's, okay, we'll do some dungeon crawl. The way will not open till the heart knows that it's safe. Four wisp must, are you serious? They have to be done in an order? So you're telling me I got all the way up here just for to tell me that like, hey, you can't go through this yet. You gotta go collect the other four things. And it even, this one is auto chosen. This is listed as the first, oh no, it's not. It's listed as the second one. Hmm. Great, okay. Well, luckily the warp point's right there. That's a little, that's a little upsetting <laughs> that we have to get the other ones before we get here. At least we did all the platforming ahead of time, so we just need a warp here when we're ready. But okay, <laughs> so we basically did that one, but we haven't gotten to the dungeon yet. So let's go warp to the Will of Wisps. Uh, objective focus. So, oh, it's right there. I'm an idiot. I went way out of my way to get that. All right, so let's warp to here. All right, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Okie dokie. One second. Doop. Alright. Let's... So we just need to go there. Something we've already been to. Something really easy to get to. And instead of going to that one, I decided to go all the way to like the end of the map to get to the last dungeon that I can't even open yet. Okay, this guy is scary. I can't bash off him. Oh god. Woo, two for one. Oh, I can't even go up that way. Okay. Triple jump is sick. <laughs> All right, 
Yep, we're just going this way. Apparently we can go higher here. Oops. But I don't know. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be a really easy... Oh my god. Uh, is this where the tree was blocking my way? Okay, I actually want to go this way. Well, actually, what, what does this do up here? <laughs> hmm. Okay. Now we're climbing. And since we got the burrow ability, we can actually do this now. Where the hell am I? Um, we can get a we can do a little bit of a, a speed run thing. Oh. I thought that was sand. <laughs> I did not realize that was a uh, convert excess energy life to excess light. Okay. Another conversion. Alright, we can do a little speed run here. Which is great. Because it gives you a ton of money. And we're actually not doing all that well on money. Okay, we have 2,500. <laughs> we're not doing poor on money. Alright, so it's right down there. We just gotta go from there to there. And I think we're gonna do that first. And then we'll do the Will of Wisps. Once I figure out where... I think I can just fall down here. <laughs> Right. And the thing is right over here, so we can go ahead and hit that. And it's, yeah, we just did it, so it shouldn't be that hard. Alright. Oh. Oh, come on. Alright. Retry it. <laughs> Alright, messed up on the first one. We won't do that again. I messed up again. <laughs> All right, I gotta remember I have an extra double jump to give me a little height if I need it. What? Oh. All right. This is just practice. Who knows? We might. No. No, we didn't. Okay. Do it again. This one for sure. Why does he get so much more height than I do? Is he doing something different? I keep dashing instead of grabbing. All right, this time. Oh, I couldn't go through that. All right, you dash into sand and you grab onto to ropes. not oh my gosh so so perfection all right we're getting a little bit better each time though and that's all that you need to do that's not the gosh it's not the direction i wanted to go Yeah, but at least they're real sh the, the spear trials are real short, though, so, like, when you mess up, it's not like you feel like you'll never be able to do it, which is nice. Gosh. Why are GameCube games so expensive? Because they haven't made them in 20 years. <laughs> they're, people always, I guess they're not playing as well. I just emulate everything for GameCube, but yeah, they are super expensive. 
I know that, um, like, melee's cost has gone down significantly. Alright, I think we got it. No! I folded. I, you bought one for $130? Oh, God. Alright, alright, we'll do it again. The music's good, at least. <laughs> We go dash across, dash up. Let me just go like this. Nope. What? You, what? He stuck to the wall. <laughs> oh, do it again. Do it again. Don't. What is the black label for Luigi's Mansion? What makes that dip? Is that like the the first edition? Dang it! Dang it! Okay. I know I have a copy of the original Luigi's Mansion. I have a good collection of GameCube games, just cause like. I just had the... I basically only bought, like, the Nintendo exclusive ones. So I have, like, Luigi's Mansion, Double Dash, Melee, Sunshine, all of those. But honestly, like, I never play them on the GameCube. Oh. Alright, don't grab the wall. No! God! You can make big money off it? Well, they're only going up in value. There's no reason to sell them right now. Is my understanding. The only thing I'm concerned of is that they're currently at my parents' house, along with my, like, GameCube. <laughs> oh, get... So as long as they don't throw... I, I'm going to be so upset. I know I'm going to come home one day and it's like, oh, we threw that out. You haven't played it in years. It's like, no, that's my retirement fund. I don't know what a Roth IRA is, but I know what GameCube games are. Alright, so this one I... Gotten so close. Yeah, I think it's probably about like, you know, five, six hundred bucks worth of games sitting around. I think the general console by itself is worth nothing, though. A Wii on Amazon is still a hundred... A Wii? The most, one of the most popular game consoles of all time is that much money? That's insane. I know my buddy wants me to bring him my old Wii because he wants. God, I keep doing the wrong thing. He keep he wants to hack it and use it for something else. I don't know. I was just gonna give it to him because <laughs> I do not play my Wii at all. Right, we go down. No! Okay, the bubble got it. Got it. Woo! Thousand. Let's go. They're all refurbished. Woo! That only took a hot second. We did it! Got the money. Dang, a Wii U's at it? I guess the Wii U was... So the Wii U is a lot less popular than the Wii was, though. So I make that makes sense why it'd be more expensive. There's just less of them. Okay, I, I can just go this way, I think. That's obnoxious. Okay, let's see. I think I'm just in the wrong area. Just go across like this. Alright, so now I keep going this way. I'm gonna grab some more things. I did see that they released the, uh, <laughs> the analog pocket finally. It's like a, it's like a new piece of hardware to play old Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games. And the thing just looks sick. It's like 200 bucks for it, but like, with the cost of like gaming consoles going up, like if you wanted an original Game Boy, it would cost you something like that anyway. 
And this one, it plays so much cleaner. Like, the screen is, like, an insane resolution, like, better than phone screens. And the games look phenomenal. I thought about getting one of them, and I was like, when was the last time I played any of my like, Game Boy Color games? On a Game Boy Color. <laughs> I think they really just need to release the the Switch, uh, the Switch emulator for Game Game Boy games, like they did for the NES, and now I guess the Nintendo 64. So I really just want one console that can play all of oh god, all of my old Nintendo games. The GameCube cons I guess I have more like a thousand dollars worth of games and, and things then, which is sick. Okay, finally got out of the the silent ones, it looks like. Oh, nope. Nope, there's still things. Still things trying to kill me. Now we're out, though. Right? Yeah. Okay. God, freaking bugs. God, the rapid fire, man. Oh, God. Man. I guess I could have traveled there. That's probably been a better place to fast travel to. But we're already in too deep. Where's the... Nope. Want to join a resale Discord? They're charging a month... The Discord is charging a monthly fee? Just to join it? That's insane. And all it is is a place to resell old games? Is that all it's for? Games and consoles? God, I missed it. Alright, so we got this one, and then we go whoop, and then we go whoop. Hit that one that time. Alright, bubble. Up to here. And then go across. Oh god, there's this thing. Go around it. Can't die anyway. Come on. <laughs> Alright, shoot me. Now go around it. Ignore him. Shoot the bee. Shoot the bee. I guess they're more like bugs than bees. Anything good up here? No. Oh, we're in water now. Okay, cool, 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 cool. And now we're out of the... Hold A to swim faster. Okay. Ah, it's a YouTuber. Well, they need their money too. <laughs> I guess. That seems like a real shitty thing to like, make people buy into your Discord. It's basically just Facebook Marketplace. It's not very good for building a community, but it's good for making money, so, I mean, it's really whatever you're trying to accomplish in your thing. There's our owl baby that we're trying to recover. Oh! So this, I'm right in the will, I, this just, oh. I'm so confused. Okay, no. The Will of Wisp. One, two, three. When the Willow died, Wisp of the Tree were scattered. One, two, three, four. Oh, there's only four you have to get. Okay, the fifth one is just getting them all together. Wait, but this one required. The one in the sands required four orbs. What? Okay, that one wouldn't open. This one is just to heal our buddy. So bar's reach is probably... Bar's reach. So we need to go to this one. Well, unless they're listed alphabetically. In which case, I don't know which one I need to go to first. Oh, they was, okay, there's only three listed. These you can do any order you want, I assume. Okay. Whew. Real bad at navigating the okay. So this one is up here. So we probably want to take this route. This was covered by a bear. 
So I don't know if that one's possible to get to. Anyways, let's go to the fast travel point, and then we'll go from there. I was going to get the new Game Boy, but yeah, $219 is not... It's real expensive. And to be completely honest, the only games that I really play on there are Pokemon games. And those, like, after you play it on an emulator, you can speed the whole thing up. Just like, man, it's hard to go back. It's hard to go back to playing that game, you know, with no speed up function. At least for me. Alright, so let's see here. I guess we'll go here and then go up there and see if we can get past the bear now. I'm hoping that the, the bear stopping us is moved. I guess, okay, so what I got now, I got the, the feather. Maybe I can tickle him with the feather and make him move. That might be the that might be what I'm supposed to be doing. I guess we have money now. Let's see if Twillin has anything to, to sell me. I can upgrade any of these. I'm not using any of them though. We'll upgrade our splitter shot to five, because that's sick. So it's shorter, but it does a ton more damage now. Apparently I can't jump on that. Okay. Just kind of dash across here. All right. Now he's got to basically head up. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. Well, actually, I haven't been over here yet. Yeah, free Gorlock Ore. We got five of them now. I'm attempting to buy another PSP Pearl White. $382? Yeah, I would say that's a little too rich for my blood. And I spend a lot of money on things that I shouldn't spend money on already. God, that should be hard to justify. Nope, I want to go up more. Alright, so up... All right, now let's go to the bear. I'm gonna get some, I, I'm really low on health. All right, so the bear's up here. I'm gonna go ahead and... set my feather to be. And I'm hoping I can tickle the bear, you know? Oh, never mind. There's a cutscene. We're entering, listen. We're entering the domain of the great bear. <laughs> He sleeps ahead, weary of the decay, but the memory of the forest remembers the spring. Maybe we can remind Bear and wake him up. It was the feather. Let's go. We made him sneeze. That's why the feather's good. Oh, he looks so sleepy. I've dreamt of your arrival, spirit. But you are too late, and this land is too hard, too cold. The spring blossoms sleep under the ice, high upon the mountain's peak. There's nothing to do but sleep. Alright, so the bear's a little depressed. He's not gonna help us out too much. But at least we can move past him now. He is the sleepiest of animals. Bears are, in general, the sleepiest of animals, though. Like, that's insane that they sleep for, like, months out of the year. That's actually inc incredible. Where am I supposed to be going? Basically anywhere I want. Can I do anything with these icicles? Oh, I slip off the icicles. Okay. Got it. So I'm probably going to need, like, an upgrade for, to deal with that. For right now, we're going to go in here. No, we're not. It's blocking our path. So we're going to go up then. <laughs> Hmm. They have a needler from Halo on Amazon. It's a dart gun from Nerf. $99 half time to, to do it. So, uh, Lego also makes one. It's like a full-size uh, needler. 
I don't know how much it is, but that might be... That's what I would do. Because one... Oh my god. Because one, you get a Needler. It ultimately is going to be wall art, I think. But two, you get a Lego to build. Which is great. What is this thing? I don't know. We're going to keep going up. Or, or not. Apparently that's as far as I can go. Okay, my my bow and arrow is kind of phenomenal now. Um, let's see here. So I can't really go left, I don't think, unless these guys can break this ice. Yeah, I dude, Legos are too expensive though, I'll be honest with you. Uh I went to a site that makes like knockoff Legos. Oh, they can break like this. How's that guy not dead yet? Okay, apparently they can't break that. Um, what what am I supposed to do here? So the Yeah, I can't break it. The birds can't break it. I guess we can go try a different path. I mean, there's a rock here, but I can't like move it. This lets me get up. It's kind of insinuating I can break that and get the ore. I don't really need more ore. Though. I I don't know what this this thing is. I guess it's covered nice. I need to warm it up. Yeah. No idea. Oh, spikes again. Yeah, those things just break. I can't go in the water. Hmm. Yeah. Not quite sure where I'm supposed to be going. Is there a, there's something this way. That's blocked off by a Wait, can I break that? Was I stupid and I can just like No, I can't. Okay. Interesting. Let's move this rock down. <laughs> Let's, I think this will probably land on our bear. Okay. That'll work. I was looking for a Lego Deedler and found a Lego Glock. <laughs> <coughs> I think my favorite is people that take real guns and make them look like toys. Which is like, you know, you know kind of ridiculous. But I think I found, it's like a real Glock you can get. Oh, we can boil the pot. Ah, and then what we can probably do, all right, let's kind of redirect it. Nope. Okay, I probably want to redirect it at the thing. All right. Okay, missed that one. That's okay. Yeah, I was expecting the rock just to hit the bear to give him some incentive to help us out. That was too high. Oh, that thing eats me. Oh, now I'm up here again? Do I have to move the rock again? I do have to move the rock. Yeah, I thought we were just here to piss the bear off. I didn't realize we're just breaking the uh, <laughs> the wood. And the bear is like, no, I don't care. He is the sleepiest of boys. I guess I'm going to kill this thing. Just to make my life a little bit easier. Oh, and I burned myself to death. All right, it's not that hard. The, the puzzle is very simple. I'm making it very difficult for whatever reason. Oh, I wonder if I can wake him up again. No, he only needs to sneeze once. I guess he's awake. Oh no, he just he just zzzs. Zzz. All right, now. Now everyone's dead. All right. There we go. And now I can probably do something here. Or this just warms up. 
What? Okay, that thing's not affected by fire. I gotta eventually get a way out of here. What do you do? Is a good question. So you... Alright, you eat me. Do I want to feed it the fire? Is that what I'm trying to do? Maybe. We're gonna launch it. Okay, straight up is not the move. I'm gonna try feeding this plant fire and see what, what happens. Missed. It's okay, it's part of the process. Okay, now it's it's not gonna like the fire. Open! I assume we gotta hit, hit it's like inside the mouth, like while it's open. Like that? Okay, that didn't do anything. Can I blow this around? Okay, that freezes things. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, so now everything's hot. I can't. Everything's melting. So I'm gonna try just to get out of here, I think. All right, that's all I need to do. Is that just a proof of concept to tell me how to utilize Oh, the whole world's a little more... Okay, that freezes a lot more than just that room. Good to know. And now we can probably advance in the area a little bit more. Perfect. So these things, I can climb now. Oh my god, what the hell is that? <laughs> Everything wants to kill me. Yeah. Alright, I've turned that on. And that opens the door. Perfect. Beautiful. Love switches. Okay. Go down here. Yeah, dude, this game loves murder plants. <laughs> they they saw the Venus flytrap and they were like, what what do we need for monsters in this game? And they were like, well, look no further than the Venus flytrap. That is the only game enemy you're gonna need to know. Okay, so it looks like our general goal. Well, this guy just does not take a lot of damage. Oh, we can only get from the side, okay. What? He's cold and mad. Well, in fairness, I get pretty upset when I'm cold too. Wonder if fire will hurt him more. <laughs> that was a bad move. Fun little bird. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I know, dude. I'm trying to help you out. Why you gotta be so mad at me? Damn. This thing launches just a. Gosh. Alright, what if I hit him with fire? Oh, it's a one tap. Oh, he does not like being on fire. Woo. Okay. So cold boys don't like heat. Where's the thing I'm trying to get this to? Way over here. Okay. So I guess it's just a, a combination of multiple bashes. Okay, but I gotta be I gotta be careful where I launch myself. 
to make sure I can still do it over and over and over again. So we're gonna make sure to get lots of height on basically everything. Woo, made it happen. Can you pull me up here, please? Okay, now this is on. <laughs> GG, <laughs> thanks. Ah, now the question is, <laughs> <laughs> do I want to go all the way back here? Ooh, I do want to, I'll try it once. I'm going to try to bring this thing all the way over here to one-shot this guy again. Because I think that'd be funny. Alright, never mind. <laughs> we tried it once. Yeah, we're going to ignore that, man. Um, Let's see here. Okay, so nothing's on fire over here. Oh god, how do I get past it? Good question. Maybe I bring him over here. Do you think he can... Oh, I can break this. Cool. That's free money right there. Sir, I can't get past you. Like, I don't want to kill you, but I guess that's what I'm doing. Okay, thank you. And I am gonna heal a little bit. <laughs> I think that would be nice and helpful. Alright. Can I... Okay, so I don't want to put this out. Okay, so this area also needs to be warmed up. But there's not like a place for me to put it. I can put it out. Does that impact anything over here? Absolutely not. Okay. Gonna lurk for a bit while I work. Good luck with the rest of your work. And thank you for helping me out on the uh, the shriek section. Oh, maybe I can just go down here. Is there anything for me to... Nope, you already did this. Okay. Woo! Throw you up there. Not quite far enough. Um, yeah, let's just try turning this on and then leaving. Now, I'm hoping I can, like, warm this place up from a different avenue later. Alright. Well, that's not high enough. Okay. They really liked you to get good at, at bashing in this game. Which makes sense, because it is kind of like the core mechanic of the game. Now everything's hot. Let's get out of here. And see what it did up top. So what are they boiling in here? What kind of soup? It looks like it's like a thing for soup. Okay, so it looks like... Anything over here? Ah, map maker. You look pretty cold up here. Yeah, maps are good. I would, I'm gonna purchase all the maps. Wow, there's a lot to do over here in there. Okay. Not gonna worry about that yet. Okay. Okay, we're up here now. And we're met with a frozen wall. Okay, so how to get that done? All right, it's a free ore right there, baby. Um, whew, the triple jump coming in clutch. I don't think I'll ever get rid of that charm. So here I'm gonna try to get underneath it. That's okay, the sand 
does in fact reform. Then this just gets speed up. And we got a spirit shard. Deal bonus damage when over half life. Interesting. Might end up using that. I don't know. To be honest, I'm normally below half life. Just because I'm really bad at healing myself. So this. Oh my gosh. I gotta stop dashing through. Oh my gosh. Just get out of here. <laughs> 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 All right. All right. All right. What else is here? So we need to go over that way. And I can just land on this. Perfect. And we got Takatu. I actually forgot his name. There's Shriek again. See that? She's almost majestic when viewed at a safe distance. Shriek began hunting these heights when the wind turned cold. I'm a bit of a wonder myself, but I don't imagine curiosity spurred that bird to roam. Maybe these frozen wastes are just nice than what she's living, leaving behind. Damn, that's gotta suck. Imagine that your previous place you were living was like better, like so much worse than this. Hmm. Okay. So it's probably like a fire orb this way. Hmm. I don't know. It's way up here. Alright, so our first step is to get this. Hmm. Okay. Not quite. Close, though. Let's do that again, but be a little more precise. Then all these ice shards will melt. Alright. Bring it down here. Uh-huh. Damn it. Just hit by my own flame. Hoisted by my own batard. <laughs> and then I murdered myself with some spikes. Oh, that's... Alright, that's fast strats, though. We're back up here. And I missed it. And I've gotten hurt. And I'm not gonna die. I thought about it for a second, but I'm not gonna do that. We're just gonna climb up. All right, come here. That should hit it, right? Yep, okay. So I wanna get this key shard right here. Then I think what I can do is actually climb up this. Get over here and try to bait one of these guys into shooting me over this way. We'll grab that key shard. Perfect. All right. Hmm. So I'm wondering. Oh, this, wa this water's clear now. Okay. Get the free money. Oh, I didn't see that guy at all. I didn't notice that. Um, let's see, do I have key shards? Yeah, I do have those key shards. Um, looks like there's one above me. Can I land on that? I can. So we're just gonna crawl this way. Grab a key shard. Perfect, swing up. Grab that. And then we gotta swing up again. Grab that key shard and probably part of this ice wall, something over here. Yeah. Nice. And there's our door. Phew. Okay. Let's see. What's over this way? Oh, a tree. All right. Let's see here. What, what do you think it's going to be? So this land is full of cold. Hmm. Hard to tell. Let, let's see what it gives me. Light burst. 
Explosive sphere for melting things. Okay. Cool. So there's probably something like... Okay, so these things are that. Nice. Oh! <laughs> okay, well... <laughs> Let's try it again. Okay, well, also, it didn't... Okay. I get it. I can bash off my own light charges, which is cool. Oh, it's saying I can use them to get up. Got it. Okay, that's pretty sick. Like, they gave me an ore up there, and it looks like I can get it by using this. Ooh, a house. I can light torches. Okay, if I... Okay, or not. I don't have any more energy. Okay, I would love to have lit that torch. I don't have a way. I need to get some energy first. I think there was an energy block around here. Yeah. Let's go light those... Let's go inside that house again. See what... It, it's gotta have something good. It's got a little hobbit hole. Alright, so... Okay, that's lit. That opens the door. Good, and it gives me a seed. Okay. Cool. I don't know what to do with all these seeds. I've collected, like, a good amount of them. I'm not exactly sure what they do. Okay, we're full on that. That's good. Now we can use the bash to get up. Alright, so now for this, we're gonna throw it like that. And get the ore. Perfect. Look at me. You can go higher here. Nope, I can't land on any of those. All right. All right, sick. The only problem with that is it uses a lot of energy to throw those things. All right, we're gonna go swim. Oh, come on. What? They one-shot him before. Alright, give me that good money. Um, so... Looks like I've explored this whole area, so we gotta go around now. This way and down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there was like a little ice wall blocking our way before. We need energy. That's why it gives us energy. Very nice. Good. And now we can make this thing happen. Save the game. Perfect. And immediately get stopped by this. What the hey? Um, okay, so I can't open that, so I guess we'll go around again. Down here? Yeah. Ooh, that one was bad. God. I don't want to grab onto his tongue. Stop. <laughs> Stop it. Dang it, I'm dead. All right. So I'm just trying to go straight down and explore these other sections. I think... <sighs> okay, it only it does spit me out, which is nice. They could have had that be an insta-kill. And I'm glad they did. That is kind of hard to get away from. <laughs> so now we're down here. Oh. Come on. There we go. Money! Alright, and if I remember correctly, there was like an ice barrier over this way that I wasn't able to get across before. Okay. Dang. Definitely want this energy. Thank you. All right, now we can go this. No, I can light this. 
And for some reason, once it's lit... Oh, perfect. I don't know how that candle is controlling is acting as a switch. Doesn't make a lot of sense to me. And now it's saying that I should use my fun new attack to gain additional height. Ooh, a Moki. Uh, will you share my campfire? A gust of is blowing my campfire. I'm hiding in a cave. Don't have food to share. Dreams of soup. He wants soup. Okay, now we're up here. This is where we were before. And it looks like if I had to guess... I'm supposed to use this new thing to do something like this. Oh, that plant also kills me. Got it. Every plant is evil. So now I've lit in this thing. That's not the right word. I have lit it? I don't know. Who the hell am I? Did I fall down? All right, I need to get some more. Oh, I, okay, that thing also gave my health back. That's good. All right, so now we can get through here. Oh, that light opens that up. That's good. Oh, God. God, I'm just fumbling everything. So we go up here. Get up like this. Throw the orb. Get a little bit of extra height. Get up here. Got to use the orb again. Gain even more height. So it wasn't the plant that was evil. That guy was just hiding behind it, I guess. All right, now we got a, a guy with his tongue here. Oh. He's dead. Good. Um, yeah, we're just kind of going around here. Oh. Whew. All right. Now this thing needs to be. Okay, he has spiked himself. Yeah, I can throw that far. Yes. Yes, I can. Oh my God! Big snowball. Okay. And we get to this. Nice. Life cell fragment. I have way too many of these. And, like, I never heal myself anywhere near enough. I always have, like, between three and five <laughs> hearts at any given time. Alright. Should probably focus on doing that better. Um, okay. So, this one, it looks like it wants me to hurl one of these bad boys. Because it gives me the little energy block there. money up there, but it's not big. So I'm not too concerned. Alright, what does that do? What is lighting? I think it opened a door back here, probably. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Um, I'm hoping... Well, that's not a door. It needs me to break it. Um, let's see here. Hmm. Sure is a puzzle. Alright, so we get over here. Gotta light this candle. What if I can go down that way? I can go down this way. Nice. Uh, all right, so we got this orb thing up there. Frick. That, those, all those things want you. Wow, we will go all the way back here. Okay. Um, do it again, I guess. I don't even know what that freaking candle does. I don't know why I'm not able to bash off these things. There we go. Okay. God. <laughs> Boom, bam. 
Boom, boom, bam. And I missed and threw another one. Now I can go down this way. Get hit by a fish. These fish will jump out of the water. I think I can make it work. All right, come here. Now we're over here, we can break this. Make my life a little bit easier without getting back. Um, we got this little serpent thing. That is just obnoxious. God, I'm trying to bash off this. Whatever, we should meet. Yeah, nice. This does count as a save point. That's good. So give me these energy crystals. So I assume the move here is to throw this guy. I'm right next to it. Why? It's not bashing. I'm right next to the thing and it's not grabbing it. It's... What? Am I not holding it? Like... Oh, I gotta charge it up more to bash off it. Got it. That makes sense. Didn't tell me that. I thought they were all the same. What? What? Okay. Okay. God. I guess I can stand next to it and throw it? It's hard to say. Oh, okay. I'll figure this out. Just, just. Okay, that will work. Touch the thing. I think this is enough. God, that was so cumbersome. <laughs> I don't know why that was so difficult. Boss fight, boss fight, boss fight. All right, so how, so he's gonna swing and then I'll go bam, 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 bam. He's gonna swing, I'm gonna throw a lot of fire at him. Throw a lot of fire at him. That was pretty easy. We got a stink bug. Oh, we've used all of our energy already. Okay. Gonna use your projectile against you. The stink bug is there, that's fine. That should kill it. Good. Now we get another one of these guys. Which is great. Um, so we're going to get him to use his hand. Oh my god. Another one. Uh, this is crazy. That's insane. Well, I guess we'll do it again. Holy heck. That second one of these guys really messed me up. Really hit different. Alright. Alright. But he only has the hammer, so he has no, like, quick attack. Everything is very long and stretched out. We got a lot of time to hit him. Deal with the stink bug. Alright, maybe I should deal with the, the bugs in the air first.
Wow. Okay. That was really poorly done. I think we're gonna focus on the bugs in the air next time. Alright, so this first guy is really simple. We basically just bait him into hitting us. Dodge it. Get a lot of good licks until he stops blocking it. And every time you use a hammer, we basically just go and hit the crap out of him. Until I go too close and just touching him hurts me. What? Okay, now we're... There we go. Okay, now we're gonna deal... The stink bug's on the ground, but he's not our main enemy right now. We're gonna focus on bombarding these guys. Okay. Okay, now we got those taken care of. Now we can focus on the stink bug. Just like that. Um, let's go ahead and approach this thing. I'm gonna go ahead and heal. I think that will be beneficial. Uh, and then for the remaining energy, we will use the Light Burst. Okay, now we got two of these guys. God. Woo! No, not this way. Okay. God! Had nowhere to run. Do it again, but better. First guy's pretty straightforward. You bait him into hit. Got. Get me out of here. Because I can get over him, but I need to do a perfect triple jump. And now I'm down to like no health. Is not great. I don't have enough energy to just mindlessly spend it. Mirror. Can you shoot me? Thank you. Alright, now come here, bug. You grab this money. You're pretty straightforward. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and put it on the regen. And we're gonna heal. Basically as much as we can. Because these guys are me. Alright, so I need the second one to spawn. One down, one to go. Now it should be pretty simple to get this done. And these should be the last of this little combat section. I, oh my god, why are you holding on to that? What's not, what are you doing? What the hell is that? Why would you be able to climb on that? It's like a little post. Alright. There we go. Grab some extra health right here. Nice. And now I gotta go to the bathroom. Too many liquids.
All right. Cool. So it looks like if we go up, that gets us to our temple or our dungeon. But it looks like on top of that, we can also go down. And I kind of want to do that first. In general, I like moving bottom to top, if possible. Okay, so now we're in this old zone. Oh! Viral! And spirit in your own kitchen. Apologize for the chill, more to the fire. You're used to the cold. This guy's apparently a master chef and will feed me. And this gets, this is kind of a, okay. So this is like a hub port. So now I'm up here. Okay, cool. This is a way of getting back to kind of the main hub from over here. Gotcha. So apparently, hmm, I think what I'm gonna try to do, I think I can get up there is what I'm try. I'm gonna try to do. I think I can make this work. So in general, what I'm gonna try to do. Well, actually, I don't know if I can get up there, or if there's any benefit in getting up there. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything up there. I mean, it looks like there is, but I don't think there is. Anyways, we're gonna leave then, <laughs> with that in mind. All right, um, apparently there is some more stuff this way. But since we can make our own fire now, let's just try that. So now the water is not frozen. Let's try to eat me. And we can get a spirit shard. Convert melee damage into energy. What? Uh, yeah, I would like to train. Yeah, that's a, that's a sick one. Uh, screw my extra hearts. No. Yeah, every time we hit something, we get energy back. That's sick. I for sure want that. So how much? That's a good amount. That's a ton. Yeah, just killing him gave me a full cell of energy. That's freaking sweet. Um, is there a way to get out of here? I think. Oh wait, wait, wait. I was gonna have to put. I was gonna equip the uh, the feather again, but I can just do this. And now we're out. Um, and then this I can just float through. Yeah, let's go get all of our, our shardy boys. So this looks like it's all... Well, there's definitely one up here. Nope, that's money. Still good to have. Oh, that hurt. Uh, okay. Gonna grab this. You gotta do it all in one go as well, because if you die in here... You won't get any of the 6-6 six, six shard, but we're not gonna die in here. Is that three? Yeah, we just need the last one, which is at the end here. Which is why I saved it for the last. And the door is right this way. Is this the, the speed run? It's literally just go there to there? Okay. Okay.
How does this work? It wants me to... Okay, I can collect all of them fast. I can do that. I think. So it's gonna... It's probably gonna go for the top one first. We're gonna end with that one. So we're gonna go up here. Okay, I messed up big time. I don't know. I don't know what the routing is. I don't know if this is better or worse than, than that thing's route. We got three already. So that guy looks like he's going to finish well before me. Oh, the spikes! Oh, I gotta throw him in there. No! Okay. Okay, that one worked out. Uh, let's try it again. We'll go for the one that he goes through first. We're also doing a bit more fast falling than he is, so that should help out as well. So we like this, because it kind of loops us back around. And let's just get two. Start high, go low. He went down here first. Uh, that might have been faster. I don't know. Now we have all four. We are ahead. We gotta remember to actually put them in the thing. Okay, we were well ahead, and we got it. That was no problem. Easiest thousand credits I ever got. All right, so that whole thing was essentially just for thousand credits, but it does also unlock this world from the hub world, which is good. We like that too. Hmm. This is just a paraglider section, I guess. Gonna want that energy, that sweet, sweet energy. Um, and some health would be good as well. Woo! Kinda on the, the edge of glory here. There we go. Oh, I wanted him to hit the spikes. Alright, so this one we're going to need to use our new fire to get us up somewhere. This one I think is basically the same. I'm going to ignore both those guys and just go straight up. <laughs> Um, and we're at the top. Or it looks to be the top. Yeah, little cutscene bit. Alright, we found the will oh, willow. This one looks like a, um, I don't know. A cherry blossom. Is this what a wisp looks like? Oh, okay. So they're not dungeons. Well, there's Sheik. Shriek. Not Sheik. <laughs> not Zelda. Do we fight it? No. Run. Escape sequence. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. There we go. I could bash off those. 
Alright. He's gonna break that, so we can do triple jump across. Now we do this, avoid that one thing. Good. Alright, and we just kinda go whoop. And land on this nice and safely. You only need to Ah! Stop! Stop holding on! You have to let go! Alright, that works. Okay, this is fine. Apparently there's an enemy there. <laughs> And we're good. <laughs> I like how they threw an enemy in there just for funsies. Open your eyes, little spirit. You are safe now. You've awoken the forest memory, and me with it. Let's go! Sleepy Bear is on our side now. Almost didn't find you in all that snow. Almost didn't recognize you with that red arm. Now spring will return to reach. So some might not welcome it. I mean, yeah, the people that live in cold environments probably won't like it. Apparently, Shriek doesn't like warm weather. She likes it cold. So this is where our outlet fell. <gasps> she was born from dust. Rising as the world fell beneath the ashes. Oh, that's so gross. Who's supposed to feel bad for this thing? Nah, screw that thing. That's an abomination. That's like a thing of science that you created in a lab, and then it ultimately comes to fruition, and you're like, no, we can't let this thing survive. We gotta kill it. We can't have this thing walking around. So it grows up, it leaves the silent woods. It sees the other owls, and it's like, hey, I want to do that. Doesn't it have wings? <gasps> it's Koo's family. It's like, hey guys, can I be, can I hang out with you? You guys can be friends? And they're like, maybe. I thought it was gonna be like an anti-bullying PSA, but it looks like they're gonna accept them into our, their crew. Oh no, the parents are there and they're like, nah, hell no, you get the heck out of here. Screw you, you weird leg creature. You don't get to hang out with our kids. Those are our kids. We're gonna play D and D and all this demon stuff. We don't want you around them. So then Shriek went back, and it's like, oh, no one likes me because my weird human legs. And the Moki are like, oh, we don't like you either. <laughs> You're just weird. <laughs> To ash and dust, she returned. Dust. A pitiful creature, her heart is stone. I didn't know she was like born with bones around her. Never to return. No more summer. Oh, never mind. New summer will rise and take its place. Summer's coming back. Let's go. We did it. Sick. Anyways, that is the winter section. So it looks like they're not. You don't need to get dungeons for all. The last game, you had to go through a dungeon for each objective. In this game, it looks like you just have to go get them. 
I think I like that better. Whoop. Yeah, so I'm just gonna go this way. Yeah. So now we have the burrowing ability, we got the the fire orb ability, which in general use like in that one region it's used for melting away some snow but in general it can be used just to get extra height you get a free bash wherever you want free money let's go yeah we're, we're doing pretty well we're, we're pretty rich I don't know why I thought I would climb the ladder. <laughs> oh, even more money! Uh, let's see if we can repair anything. We got like five. Yep, no more projects. Dang. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna save here. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day. We got one of the wisps, as well as we almost got another one. Like, we already got all the way to the end in the in the desert area. We're not able to do the dungeon yet till we get some wisps, but... You know, we got we got two there, and we got a save point. So we'll be able to get that done whenever we're ready. But yeah, and I guess I'm gonna finish up the other two later. So far, the game's been phenomenal. Um, I don't know how to get to there. I guess we'll do... What is the next kind of thing? Uh, so there's, where, there's this one, that one, I guess we can get to it by this, and then this one, I can get to via this, okay. Alright, so yeah, we'll get those two later. That's enough for right now. I might do another stream in the afternoon depending on what else I'm doing because I have really wanted to play more of this game but I gotta take a break so yep yeah, I'll be be playing more in the future we'll finish up Ori and then we got a great setup of games for next year that I'm excited to play as well but okay well, thanks for watching 